Oh, what a perfectly executed stroke. What a way to get going that is. And Cameron Atwell is full of talent, and when you see him play shots like this, I just wonder why he's had a run of so many low scores. Fantastic stroke again, the second gem from Cameron Akmal. That'll be 4-2. The margins are quite small if you're going to bowl short against a guy who's in and seeing it well. And it's a good test for Stuart Broad. And another one. OK, this is game on. And thank heaven for it. I think everybody around the ground would like to see Pakistan push England very close here. And I think the England team will want that as well. They want a game. You know, they want a win, playing good cricket, but they'll also want a contest. Direct hit would have done it by yards. And Owen Morgan lined it up. He almost had too long. One stump to aim at, and he wasn't good enough. Missing leg stump, just going down the leg side. Ian Gould was on the walk before uh, Anderson was halfway through his appeal. Always tough to give. It's a good decision in the end. I think it's harsh if you give that out. Yeah, nicely placed and nicely timed. That'll bring the 50 up for Pakistan. He just waits for it there and, and actually guides it in the gap through the covers. It's a good shot, good response also from Cameron Atmel. They lose a wicket, straight away is on the attack. Oh, a drop! Flying chance there, Michael Yardi into the attack. Captain Strauss just fails to grab hold of it. That's dropped. Jonathan Trott. I think he actually expected the ball to certainly come a lot harder because it was a meaty blow, but it wasn't quite timed by Cameron. That's a good shot. It's just slipped a little bit down the leg side from Yardy and Akmal, who's really fastening onto everything today, has gone to 49. That's 50 to Cameron Akmal. First real positive performance with the bat all summer by him, and it's come in 56 balls, and it's given Pakistan just a sniff of a chance. Yes, he's played extremely well. When you say a sniff of a chance, the figures are 177 more to win it. We'll find out how they cope after the break. There he goes again. He's smeared it to Stuart Broad, straight down his throat. Swan galloping towards Stuart Broad, perhaps out of relief as much as satisfaction. That is a big wicket. Akmal had to take the lead role. He's the guy who's got in, a side that's so lacking in confidence, it's much more difficult for new people to come in, and Akmal has gone. Caught at uh, long off. Graham Swan has his 50th wicket in the one-day international cricket, and it's 1-0. 